Lexington's new soccer team held its first ever practice today, just one week after a site was approved for a new stadium. Bodie Brooks talked to the president of Lexington Sporting Club as the preseason kicks off. Yeah, Marvin Imani, this has been a long process for the Lexington Sporting Club. It was in January last year when the Lexington Sporting Club first unveiled a proposal right here on Fox 56 for a stadium next to Rupp Arena. But developers decided to go a different route. So in June, a proposed stadium and youth soccer fields were planned for an area around Newtown Pike and Russell Cave Road. That led to some backlash from farm owners and even the mayor. So last week, Lexington's Planning and Zoning Commission approved changes to move ahead with the stadium near Athens Boonesboro Road, finally setting the next steps in motion. The club's players held their first practice today as they get ready for the first match next month. This is really going to happen and a lot of folks I think uh, up until this point have doubted quite a bit. Um, the amount of excitement that we've seen from season ticket deposits and from our youth club has been absolutely amazing. Uh, so, so we've known it's going to be a reality and it's been coming fast and furious for us, uh, but it has been a long process and just working through the city, uh, all the city approvals and overcoming those hurdles. Gabbard says the club still doesn't have a firm timeline for when the stadium will be completed, but is shooting for being done by 2025. In the meantime, it will be playing home games in a temporary facility. An announcement about that is coming soon. The first home game is set for April 8th. Mark.